it's happening. All right now, <sighs> give me tea. I'm not here for you. Hmm? Oh, you break your back. Can y'all not see this sitting on my fireplace? Mm-hmm. This is our karma. Ooh. Hey, ride or die game. Baby! I really need a monthly Starbucks budget. Why not, shall we? I am rooting for you. You are stronger than you think. Oh. Well, a little commotion for the skin, please, because your girl looks the fuck good. It is glowing, clear, glass, just, ah, I love that for me. Anyway, you guys, what is up? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm Shanice Alicia, and welcome to another weekly vlog. I know, right? Mm-hmm another one it is wednesday so happy wednesday you guys and happy november 1st when i say i'm sitting in the car really tripped out because this is the second to last month in 2023 and if i had to go back to january and tell myself all that would transpire this year trust you believe me I want to believe myself, but I am a true walking and living testament of God's grace and his mercy. And I'm just so grateful that he has carried me through this entire year. And if that resonates with you, girl, have a praise break. Okay, because we deserve, we deserve. And I am just here to wish you guys lots of love, peace, happiness, prosperity, wealth, health, more life and more blessings as you enter this new month and as we prepare to close everything out and start a brand new year. And I'm just also here to tell you that it's not too late. It's not too late. God put that on my heart and I had to let you know. So anyway, here I am sitting outside of Sam's Club. I'm about to go in to get Twyla's labor and delivery staff some goodies. It's happening. It is happening. Baby Kai will be here any day now. Honestly, any hour, any minute. And we are just so anxious and overjoyed. We can't wait for his arrival to see what he looks like, to just peep his little personality, to give him all the cuddles and love that he deserves and everything we've just been waiting to give to him. So her mom called and asked me if I could make this quick stop. We actually were there last night. She checked in and we're just going through the process of laboring and supporting her in any way possible. So she she is in really great spirits. The staff has been amazing, hence why I'm going to go inside and grab this stuff. And yeah, Ashley will be pulling up once she gets off from work today. And we are just going to see how everything continues to play out. So if you guys are watching this, I know that he's already here, but please bow your head and just say a prayer right now. Wish her well, congratulate her and do all of that stuff because she has made it to the finish line. So I'm not going to drag this intro out any longer than what it has to be let's go ahead and get inside i'm gonna bring you guys in of course and we're going to grab whatever it is because she wasn't very specific i may send her some pictures just to kind of get a feel but y'all know everything being bulk so i'm probably gonna get like an assorted something and take it on to the hospital so let's go ahead and go in would these be good y'all i'm not sure but her dad mentioned these jokingly earlier so i'm just trying to figure out or should i do this little assorted tray because this gives variety if everybody doesn't like chocolate okay scratch all that basic betty shit do y'all see this so so cute these assorted celerosa mini bottles they have the black original lemon lime mm, stella berry and stella peach yeah, yeah, we gotta get this. This is perfect, and it's only $20. Like, how could I not? This has something for everybody, whether you like semi-sweet, a little sweet, a little flavor, red or white. And I think she's seen about four nurses today. A few have been in and out of the room because we just survived, we lit. So I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get the box of chocolates and let me see what else i find Phew. okay that was quick easy and painless now i'm trying to see if i should go get a little bag for them and dress it up cute with some tissue paper of course so that we can present it or 
will it be cute in just that little box and then put the little chocolates on the side sit it on their desk i don't know i feel like a bow would be appropriate to add with it so it don't just look like i brought something about the house but i'm gonna see because i have a 25 minute drive so whatever i see on the way whether it's dollar tree dollar general i'll probably stop in there and grab something so that the presentation can be cute but yeah y'all i just cannot get over the fact that twyla is a mom like this is crazy if you know you know life is something else like we are really growing up and i love this for us i just can't wait to see my girl in like true mom mode and then she's having a little boy so it's gonna be activity after activity and sports games us taking our lawn chairs out the trunk sitting up at the tailgate in college you know it's just wow 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 i didn't really see this for us this year but it's happening it is happening so for real this time when i get to the hospital i will pick you guys back up unless i make that stop to the dollar store to pick up a bag both whatever they moving because i was just trying to figure out whether or not i wanted to do miniature bags for everybody's little wine to go in and then do a bow on the chocolate or should i just do a bow on the chocolate and the wines and let it be like whoever takes what i think that's the vibe that i'm going for but what bow hmm Ooh. Now, I was going to commend them today because I didn't have to come in here and move furniture around. Y'all know how they always got carts in the aisle, but um, not the power flicker. Let me hurry up and get out of here before it go out completely and I'm not able to check out. And this was a wasted mission. Because what? 216. Thank you. Have a good one. Oh girl, hush. Some dressy, you know what I'm saying? Oh, between the lighting and my bang being a little greasy, she trying to give baye. Your girl is struggling right now, but listen, you guys, happy Saturday. Let me lead this conversation with my godson is here kai is a literal angel like he is so beautiful so chunky and sweet like i just want to cuddle up with him twyla did such an amazing job bringing him into this world i ain't shed no tears like that in a minute but when i say boohoo crying whoo child another story for another day last week well this week rather was a very 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 long one okay the road is never easy but we were able to make it to the point where we are today so congratulations to my girl I actually just left up there and I'm sitting outside of home goods now because Shakina is about to meet me and we're gonna do a little bit of home decor shopping she just bought a house and then also you guys know Christmas is right around the corner it's officially Christmas time now if you ask me I saw a post that said November 1 through the 20 23rd Christmas 24th Thanksgiving 25th through December 25th is Christmas all again so yeah yeah and y'all know I'm gonna get ready for vlogmas here soon so I just want to see if I'm going to change my color scheme in terms of the ornaments and whatnot that we're putting on the tree I'm considering adding a few more trees around the house let's see how much I can swindle sim into but yes you guys that is pretty much what i'm going to be doing right now as in today later on we're going to link at blue i believe to bring in ashley's birthday because it's tomorrow i'm not sure if she's going to want to do anything for her birthday tomorrow because the week that we've had just anticipating kai getting here we didn't really have much time to plan and or think out anything else so with that being said you guys have not seen me because i ain't seen myself girl i've been sitting up in a hospital room for three four days three days straight girl we tired we are tired last night was the first time laying up in my bed scratching my feet together and i barely wanted to get up out of that thing this morning but yes y'all that is pretty much all of the updates we are back on track i know i've been very consistent with the vlogging but life just be liking so 
once I get myself together between today and tomorrow I will see you guys every single day next week until we close out this vlog our anniversary is next weekend we don't have any plans because Kai's due date is actually our anniversary day so I didn't want to risk him coming that weekend and us not being in place but now that he's here we're just gonna try to see if we need to do like a staycation hit a city and catch a little vibecation whatever whatever but outside of that i know this sun is probably not the most flattering lighting that i could have and it's really not the best thing that i'm looking at in my face so i'm about to get out take you guys into home goods and i will meet y'all there and y'all will of course see shakima once i get inside she's not here yet i need to text her and see where she's at but yeah let's go shop i know y'all seen this fat ass red straw because i had to stop by chick-fil-a to grab me a caramel crunch little milkshake but we're heading in to home goods we always have good luck in here so hopefully today's the same hey sister first of all they kill me over here with these little golf carts folks be watching the videos i don't be knowing <laughs> y'all look at this cute little setup isn't it cute? Y'all picking up what we putting down? Check me out. Boom, boom, boom. Barata, pow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling it. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. We just need to fix Rachel up because we don't know her. We don't know her. We're going to put some people we know in here. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. And then put a little something up in there. Mm -hmm. And this almost looks exactly like that's what I you said. That's what I said. That looks perfect. Except it's a little grayer but mm -hmm. you know i sent her a picture for the final um, oh yeah oh yeah for the vlog mm -hmm. I like i'm digging it i'm digging it y'all i didn't know dr bronner's had toothpaste yeah i had no idea girl they really get down with these golf carts out here in peachtree city this how you know you made it in life yeah <laughs> Get a and look at her with her blanket on her beach. Y'all, all right now, Hobby Lobby need to get hip and because. Salt and pepper beer, okay. Yeah, we like that. We do. Hang on, mom. Not Wizard Kelly, but happy Sunday, you guys. I'm about to go get my nails done because last night at Blue, not even doing anything, girl. Uh, do y'all see that? Miss Ma'am, Miss Ma'am. Miss Ma'am, and y'all know, <laughs> I don't have time. It's my real nail, but I can't figure out if the SNS is just lifting or if my nail broke <sighs> up under there. So let's go ahead and get in the car and I'll meet you guys there. All right, so I just pulled up to the nail salon. Y'all remember my greasy bang from yesterday? Yeah, I put that back today. I'm not sure if I'm gonna go in here and film for y'all because it be a lot. I kind of want to chill, relax, get in and get out today. I have no idea what design I want. And y'all know with this broke nail, I'm not sure how long my nails are going to be. So I just need to really see before I make a final decision. So I'm going to go ahead and get in here, see if Ivy is busy. If she is, y'all know the drill. Going to see y'all again to run to Starbucks or if she's not, going to sit right down so I can get these soaked off. And get ready to get my new style. We still know we still Before I go, y'all, this weather's so crazy. Like, it got a little breeze to it, but it's hot. Last night, though, <laughs> leaving blue, it was freezing. I'm not really sure. What, what we doing, Georgia? What we doing? Can we get one consistent, please? Girl, Justin said come back at 2.30, number one. <sighs> Ivy is off today. I really don't get my nails done on Sunday, so of course I wouldn't know, and I'm not mad at her for being off, but well, why? And this is not going to be good if I leave it like this for another day. It's just not gonna happen. I'm gonna bump it on something, maybe even in my sleep, so I need to get these nails done. But it's currently, oh, my clock needs to change because y'all know time went back. It's 1.20 right now. So I'm gonna go over here to Starbucks, grab me my fix. <clears throat> it's been a while since I've had some. And then I'll go across the street to Hobby Lobby, walk around and get into some trouble with all of the Christmas decor. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And then I'll probably hit Ulta 
and then make my way back over here and he should be ready by then I also really just need to get these soaked off before he starts on me so it's not a longer process so I may come back a little before 2 30. I just hate breaking a nail I don't even know how that happened like I was in the restroom washed my hands and I pulled off the paper towel and as I was going to put this hand in the paper towel to dry it off girl I heard and I was like no what the hell Ooh. Ice gingerbread oatmeal. Hey, could I please try the ice gingerbread oat milk chai latte? Sure, what size would you like? Let me do a venti. Is it good? Tell me about it's it. It's pretty good. I haven't had it iced, but it's too hot. It's pretty good. Okay, perfect. Gotcha. Anything else for you? No, that's going to be all. All right. Can I get a name for the order? It's Shanice. All right, Shanice. It's going to be $13.50 a month, Thank you. You're welcome. I got a venti. I always be going for the gusto. I really should have probably gotten a grande because I don't even know how it tastes, but she said it's good. I don't know what everybody tastes palettes be like, so hopefully it gives me what I need or I'll be asking them for another pump or something. I should have maybe added some vanilla to it, but see, I'll be wanting to taste the drink, how they created it. I cannot believe we are here in Christmas time. This is wild to me. I'm gonna keep saying it. Like, what i need to be planning for some christmas photos because i said that from here on out sim and i are gonna start sending out christmas cards but we might need to try again for 2024 because girl uh, what mm. y'all when i say i love scorpios like they're my absolute favorite zodiac sign so if you're a scorpio shout out to you boo i rocks with you the long way if we locked in ain't no switching up i still haven't tried that viral tiktok drink and I'm not sure that I'm gonna try it because what's taking me so long? I stay at Starbucks. Oh, they're all festive in their Christmas gear. They got on hats, headbands, their aprons are red. They are cute. Hi, Janice. Yes. It's gonna be 13 50 Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you so much. You have a good one. Okay, let's see what it's hitting on. I don't want it to be spicy. You know how gingerbread be spicy? in the block we need to get some vanilla in here because what is this like it doesn't taste bad it tastes good but it doesn't taste like anything does that make sense and that's not necessarily good because I just feel like I'm drinking milk with a hint of chai maybe like powder in there but not like chai syrup and the gingerbread is not strong at all so let's go figure this out i have a question can i add like maybe more gingerbread and chai to it because it kind of just tastes like milk so you just want me to put it in there please thank you so much so you might need a waste like, around i'm not sure perfect thank you so much you too all right you guys so the results are in it tastes a thousand times better but what she was telling me is the gingerbread is only in the foam so essentially this is a chai latte but for whatever reason it tasted like just milk with a little bit of chai so i asked her to put two pumps of vanilla and some more chai in it and now girl <laughs> she's giving okay she real good but really quick um i'm not about to hobby lobby shit because today is sunday and hobby lobby is closed duh and I don't want to drive all the way down to Target to come back because I already know I'm going to take long in there and I want to be back here before 2.30. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do because now it's 1.40 and it's just... <sighs> Somebody said um, <laughs> the other day on Instagram, or was it Twitter? <laughs> they said ever since y'all learned about brunch three years ago, y'all ain't been to Sunday service. When I say holler, screamed. Hey guys, I'm about to um, indulge in my little breakfast sandwich or whatever. 
the impossible sandwich is really good all right so thankfully he got done a little bit earlier than anticipated it is 207 i'm about to go ahead in and i'll catch you guys once i'm out if i show y'all anything that's because i'm feeling generous because girl i'm tired phew all right you guys that was a lot but i'm finally out of the nail salon ivy wasn't here today so i was gonna sit with justin and then justin blew me off okay so then i sat with ryan and he ate down on this little set i found this on instagram like a few weeks ago and i said to hell with it let's try them out i really 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 like the little texture that's on the white part it's like a zebra tribal print type of vibe two nails are full the other nails are french and yeah he did a pretty 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 good job i'm glad to get this out of the way we are about to go ahead and make our way over to Target. I have a list of the cleaning supplies that I need. And then y'all know Target is going to tell me what else it is that I need from them. I just now finished sipping on this Starbucks drink. So it was a slow and gradual type of vibe. Not really my favorite. Probably won't get it again because I got to do too much just to make it work. So once I get over to Target, I'll pick you guys back up. So I'm picking this up for my shower saw. My mom said that this is really, really, really good. So we're gonna try it out. It's the mold and mildew remover with the bleach. Buy a saw, get you some. It's a foam too, so I'm actually going to get two of them. And it also says that it kills black mold. So I feel like this is strong. Okay. Oh, I could do some blushables too. This box looks like it stank, huh? All right. Let's ride and go look at some of the Christmas stuff now that all the responsibilities are out the way. This is such a pretty assortment of colors. This one too. Ooh, this is cute. I love this color. They also have it in this navy. Okay, variety. Look how big and pretty these are. So look who's in Target with me. Uh-oh. Hey, hey. Ride of Die gang. <laughs> What's up, y'all? I was supposed to be getting up out of here. Yeah, and, and, and saw this bun. Uh -huh. I said, now if I see a camera, I know so. You know what it is, you know what it is. She was like, sis, I was like, uh oh, how long you been up behind me? Because girl, I just mm -hmm. been in my own the world. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Over here, being grown, looking at <sighs> sheets. <laughs> sheets me not gonna buy. Because Target told me that I needed sheets today. <laughs> girl, you don't need nothing. Honestly, but Target gonna tell you. See? These chairs are really cute, ain't they, sister? They are. Uh huh, uh huh. Oh, it's soft like that. Y'all know I got my little leather pillows on the couch. I feel like these would be two cute little accents. Mm -hmm. Come on. Oh, Target run and done, my loves. Me and Tyler sat out here and we chopped it up for a quick second. And while I'm thinking about it, I actually came with the intentions of going right here to get waxed before I went into Target. So let me see if they're still open because it is currently... 505 so let me see if they're open and they can take me because i just need my armpits because it'd be getting in the way of me wearing certain things or should i really wait until our anniversary next weekend not that we have anything planned but um i'm trying to see if we should just wait to get this good old wax on time but the way these armpits are looking i just Mm. I think that I am going to wait until later on this week. So let's go ahead and head to the house. Sim is making some jerk chicken rotel. So I'm interested to see how this turns out. Leave me alone. Don't start. Okay, come on, you What's the hell with you doing? Okay, you guys, so I just made it home and I am exhausted. I'm not really sure what that's about but um yeah if you guys have noticed that my lip is busted let me tell y'all about y'all nephew do spot he thinks that he's smaller than what he actually is so as i was bending down earlier he was jumping up and playing around 
And yeah, got my lip looking fat like I get beat up. It's not okay. Come give me a hug. Apologize. Come here. Oh, you so big and tall. I need to start treating you your size. Cause you bad. Oh, hey, thanks. I'm close to the vlog. What's going on, y'all? Sim is almost done with dinner and I'm so hungry. We got these chips today. These are rounds. You know, last week we had the strips. These children are the future. Hey, you guys. Happy Thursday. I know. I know. I know, cause I was big and bad up in that car telling y'all how after last week, I was gonna be vlogging every single day this week, but for some odd reason, I filmed my organization video, which if you guys haven't seen by now, please be sure to check it out after today's vlog. And yeah, the editing for that, hmm, girl, it ran me through the mud, just a little bit, just a little bit. So I was strapped to that computer for two days. I recorded it on Monday and I'm not really sure why it took me so long to get it edited. Y'all know I had to record a voiceover and the list goes on. So here we are. Today is Thursday and I have so much to do. I have a lot to get done and I just feel like time is against me. Not really sure what that is about, but before we head out today, let me give you guys a quick little Sephora haul. Girl, I ain't even get much, but what I did get, I want to share because I wasn't a VIB member until I shopped the little sale for the insiders, which was only 15% off, I believe. But Lanisa got me a gift card for my birthday and I remembered it. It was in my text message. I was just like, let me go ahead and use my gift card and shop while the sale is going on. So you guys know I've been using this for my natural hair. It's the wow. Extra Strength Dream Coat. It's an ultra moisturizing anti-frizz treatment. So I feel like this works wonders on me, especially being that I do a lot of blow dried styles, i.e. the bun, okay? So this works really good. Y'all saw I did try to pick it up in Ulta when I went in there a few vlogs ago, but they only had the travel size. I was able to get it in the big size. I think that retails for $32. And then I got some of the Huda Beauty easy bake it's their setting powder y'all do outside he's showing out but i know queen has used this and i've seen a few of my faves using it so i got this in kanafa it's almost similar to the sasha buttercup in color that is that i can see so i'm excited to try it out and see how i like it i'm not even sure why i went for this finish but let's see let us see because i already love the laura mercier translucent powder and the honey powder so i didn't want to rebuy that because i don't necessarily need it so i just want to get something new and then i got the laneige sleeping mask so this is what it looks like it's the green box and i haven't used it yet i was going to use it last night but i said i was just going to wait until i showed you guys so can't wait to try this out and see how it works because if it's anything like the lip mask which i mean it is a different formula i know it's going to be worth the buy so i also got two sephora collection brushes the 93 which is a pro blush brush and then i got the 78 which is a pro contour brush let's see so this one is for the blush. Yeah, I see that kind of like a tapered angled brush. It's soft and fluffy too, I like that. And then let me show you guys the contour one, which I may or may not use for contour. I'm not really sure. But I do like these dense, almost flat head brushes. Y'all see that? But it's fluffy still. So, I'm not really sure what exactly I'm going to use this for, but I can just, uh, not here, maybe contour here. Mm, mm, We're going to figure it out. And then I have been wanting to try this Refi Brow Sculpt Gel for the longest. I've been seeing a few of my faves, Jayla, to be specific, using this, and I'm like... I want to try this out because I have the Anastasia Brow Pomade, like the gel, to keep your brow hairs in line. But this refi, I feel like, is super convenient because it comes in a tube like this. So let's see. I'm interested to see how this goes and how it will dry down. 
So yeah, the next time I sit down to do some really good makeup, we're gonna try out this setting powder as well as this brow gel and also the new brushes. I repurchased the photo frames for my shelves. I told you guys once and I'll tell y'all again, if anything goes down when we have company over, it's those shelves up on the wall. And I'm not playing this go around because I'm about sick and tired okay of having to rebuy these and re-put our shelves up but every single time somebody breaks it we go ahead and send an invoice go ahead and send us the money to replace it because we ain't playing with y'all stop coming to folk house breaking folk shit okay you break you by so we be having them send the money but for real for real i need them to quit coming over here and breaking that because our little wall is tired now i did consider putting them just on the wall and maybe doing the viral cute little light that goes over it like the little lamp to shine down but i don't really like that look i like the shelf look that's what i like and that's what i want so i should be able to have that in my home without it being torn up every time folk come over and get a little lit so we'll see because y'all know we're about to have company over for friendsgiving so in terms of today, it's 76 degrees outside. Got a few things that need to be taken care of. Like number one, these armpits. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and get them waxed because it's been since Sunday when I was considering. And then number two, I need to get my car washed. I parked under that tree when we went over to a music fest, which you guys saw and it did my car no good. And it's just dirty. I just need to go ahead and wash it. And then I also need to make a run to Hobby Lobby because I wanted to do that on a Sunday and I wasn't able to. What else? My parents are supposed to be coming up here. My sister's birthday is tomorrow, so they're gonna celebrate with her. Not sure what everybody's doing because I'm still not sure what Sim and I are doing. It's looking like saving this money and maybe doing a cute dinner. You know what I'm saying? And we're gonna try again next year. But uh, hopefully my mom and I are able to get into some trouble this weekend when she comes. And I'll show you guys that. Of course, it will be included in this vlog because I sat down to edit the beginning half up to 24 minutes and we got nowhere. So that's why we're here. I also talked to Lanisa yesterday and I forgot to ask her if my wigs was ready because baby, This bun, <laughs> I'm so tired of it. There's so much I could do to my hair, but there's so much I don't wanna do to my hair. Point blank period. I'm just ready to go ahead and put her up because as the season is approaching for me to be super busy every single day, I ain't got time to be fooling up with this hair, but you guys, if y'all have caught up on the organization video, what do y'all think? I know y'all put y'all comments underneath that one, but I am just, really 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 impressed as to how good everything turned out especially with the fact that i did not take any measurements so kudos to bright room products hopefully somebody from target bright room y'all watching see about me see about me so many of you guys this is just a brain dump if you're wondering because i am chatting a lot but I've also been going through comments. I had to turn my DMs off because y'all, it took me three and a half hours to go through all of my DMs between primary, general, and then request, and also the hidden messages. The other night, I had so many things to respond to because I have not been actively responding since maybe mid-September, and I try my hardest to get back to all of y'all, but yeah. Like I was saying, so many of y'all have been asking for the Apple Car Playlist. And you guys, it is linked in the pinned comment, which you have to see before you leave your comment if you're scrolling through. So check the pinned comment, also the description box. Anything that I mentioned on camera, check there first because I know you need answers as fast as possible, but sometimes I'm not going to get to you until maybe a month later. Sorry, 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 sorry. Thousands of y'all wanted me, so there goes that. But I intend to turn my DMs back on sometime. I'm not sure when, but well, I needed a break. <laughs> I needed a break. I cannot take it. So um, outside of that, was there anything else that I needed to tell you guys about? I don't think so. 
I do need to go check my PO box because I did receive DMs on a few of you guys sending me packages. So I want to make sure that I go retrieve those before the post office be trying to send them on back to you. And I think that's it. So let me go ahead and let Deuce back in. And once I get in the car, I'll pick you guys back up. Can somebody give me tea as to why dogs like to roll in their shit or another dog shit? Give me tea. Give me tea. Because Deuce about to go back to the shelter. <laughs> what is that about? Monday, I already had to give him a bath. Oh, excuse me. Before I started filming my organization video because I let him outside and he usually chills outside no issues no problems right and all of a sudden I saw him rolling around I didn't think twice about it he came inside and smelled like the farm and it was like all in his ear all around his collar I had to get him a new collar because throw the whole dog away throw the whole dog away like just ugh. Ugh, ugh. So I'm not sure what that's about because I just had to stop him from doing it just now. I caught him at the right time before he got to really submerge in himself and we pick up his poop on a weekly basis in the backyard. Even though it's our backyard, we still don't want it back there smelling up the place or just, you know, you know. So <sighs> that aggravates the living hell out of me because I would have never thought I needed to watch Deuce while he's outside you know what i'm saying like it's just crazy <sighs> i'm trying to think of when i'm going to make the move to check my p.o box because that's the opposite direction of everything else that i need to do so maybe i'll make that a priority tomorrow morning because yeah i'm just not in the business of going up just to come back all the way down and it's two o'clock girl they got the inmates out here mowing the grass and stuff and y'all know so many have been breaking out and we just ain't got time to be in the number let me move for shit Anyway, though, speaking of card playlists, why not, shall we? We got a good little drive. Not really, but we can vibe out to a little music per usual. What do I want to do today? Because the diary of a millennial, <laughs> she's going up. She is that playlist. Like, I think there's over 100 songs on there, and it's kind of ridiculous, but it is so, so, so needed. It's so needed, like nonstop. You can really ride to this. Do I want to go off the playlist or do we just want to listen to some? Ooh. We cut your such a time do y'all remember that song with him and tim mcgraw girl how was nelly on this song? come on over to my place won't you sit yourself down and take a seat with me is you my girl i heard your friend told a friend that told a friend of mine now we should do it one more time come on i love how that verse aged so well because him and ashanti like girl they make me cheese as hard as nelly has been cheesing for the past few months love that for them okay car concert cut short but we're outside of the wax salon about to go ahead in here so i can get these pits waxed up because i have no business being outside with mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. can't do it let's go Today. Um, armpits. Sure. Thank you. Have a good one. Y'all remember me telling y'all that I thought my wax girl was gone. Baby, Brittany done changed her schedule on me and she was actually here today because she's filling in for somebody. And when I say I was never so relieved to see her face because I'm not going to talk about the other Brazilian girls or whatever, but my good sis. Mm -hmm. she know what's up she know what's up so i was able to catch up with her she's doing good and i got these armpits waxed now you know it's only the test of time 
before you start getting a little mercy. So let me go take my self to Hobby Lobby first. I think that's what I want to do. And then I'll come back this way so I can hit home goods. Did I tell y'all that I was going to Target? I hope I didn't because I don't need to. I don't need to go. I just went the other day. But we are about to go to Starbees. I really want a matcha, but I'm going to try out this new drink so I can see what the vibes are because my girl sent it over to me. Now, I'm not a very sweet latte type girl. I do enjoy tasting the chai tea or the coffee that's inside of the drink. So this may be a little different for me. I may modify it some because it has like white mocha, brown sugar, and sweet cold foam on top, as well as caramel drizzle. So that's a big word for Elmo. I may dull it down just a little bit, but I will give you guys the specifications so that y'all know how to order it. So when I get to Starbucks, I'll pick you guys back up. Okay, so this drink is technically called an oatmeal cookie chai latte. So I can assume that it's going to give you the vibes of what the OG oatmeal cookie gives, right? So the specifications are when I can find my screenshot because my phone be hoeing me when I need to pull things up. Very good. Chai tea latte with oat milk. Depending on the size you get, let me just do the basic as of tall. You get one pump white mocha, one pump brown sugar, sweet cream cold foam, and caramel drizzle. So not sure if that's all in the cup or just on the top, but I may do a venti. Get the makeup just like this, even though you would technically add more since it's a bigger drink. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to just keep it one and one. And I may not get the sweet cream cold foam because that don't be nothing but flavored whipped cream on top. Essentially flavored thick milk. <laughs> and I just am not paying a dollar twenty-five for that because Starbucks really be playing with us dead in our face, dead in our face. So yeah, I'm gonna try that out. I'm gonna try that out today, and then the next time I come to Starbucks, probably when I'm with Mama, is matcha time, matcha time, matcha time, because I ain't had no matcha in a minute. Hi, thank you for choosing Starbucks. This is Soraya speaking. How can I help you today? Hi, could I please do a venti chai latte? Can I have it iced? Can I have it with oat milk, one pump of white mocha, and one pump of brown sugar? And then can I have um, caramel on top? Light ice for me, please, and that's all. Thank you. So I was on FaceTime with Twyla yesterday and I saw my little stud muffin Kai. He is so cute, you guys. I can't wait till she decides to share him with the world because I just can't get over him and those cheeks. Just a little chunky, little just irresistible baby. <sighs> my girl is a whole mother. Do y'all keep a tweezer in y'all car? Girl! <laughs> It just be that one <clears throat> little ounce of testosterone that we got up in us that be growing out that one little chin hair. I don't really too much like that for me, girl. I be keeping that right there. Y'all know what's funny? I be having all the discipline in the world when I'm in the house talking to y'all. But once I get in the car, everything just goes out the window. I get to doing everything that I said I wasn't going to do. Please, Shanice, don't go up in Hobby Lobby today and pick up any new decor. Hey, it's me, 934. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Thank you. Good you too. Y'all know I love a good chai, so I'm already banking that this is going to be good. It definitely tastes like oatmeal cookie. Yes, it does. Okay, hold on. Let me take a picture. Oh, God. They're coming. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm one of them. I'm one of them. I'm one of them. Yes, y'all. It tastes really good. To say I'm in here for something very specific would be a lie, but we're making strides in the right direction because, okay, Hobby Lobby, I'm picking up what you're putting down. 
I am. So I'm actually about to go see if I can find some ornaments. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> <laughs> you guys want to be on the vlog? <laughs> and um, then once I'm done in this little section, I'm going to go over to the stems because I want to find some inserts for the vases around the house. There's some ornaments that are like velvet in the creams and the browns family. I'm trying to find those. Literally no luck in the ornaments department, but I do think I want to do something really cute with the stairwell. A lot of you guys have sent me some inspo and I am considering just going ahead and doing it, but I need more ornaments outside of the ones that will go onto the tree probably some that are a little bit smaller because i have really big ornaments but i don't know this hobby lobby just ain't got it together but i don't like nothing maybe they have more ornaments over there maybe one out over let's go one out over why do i feel like if they were anywhere they were probably all right here yes do you guys have any velvet ornaments? Velvet. Because I saw them, you know, the girlies on TikTok and Instagram. I saw that they have some um, that are like cream, brown, right. those colors. Yes. Why are you seeing them in the store? I don't know. I haven't seen any. I haven't seen any. Okay, thank you. I'm never going to get over how like luxurious and cute these are. I've seen some in Home Goods already when I was in Augusta, but. Can we get into it? Like these are so cute and I feel like they would really go good in my bathroom and bedroom area. But girl, we got other things to worry about. Because I really haven't gotten to a stage in life where I actually decorate our rooms. I may put a little something something like I did the first year in the guest bathroom. But outside of that, girl, them rooms just be as plain. Oh, 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 I'll be changing out the hand towels. I'll do them in the season. But outside of that, I could see me standing these somewhere up in the living room area. These are super cute. The tag says Christmas, but what this is, y'all? An ornament? What this is? Because it was giving pumpkin as I was walking up. This little countdown situation is kind of cute. They have different options that you could put right here. So there's Santa, there's Christmas, there's shopping days, and there's Jesus' birthday. Okay, we're going to leave that right there. Where's it? Mm -hmm. This one is cute, too. You guys remember I got this one in the past and you put this little magnet on here and it just counts down the days with you. Oh my goodness, y'all. How cute are these? They're oven mittens. These are so cute. We still got some work to do. Just a little bit more work to do. But I mean, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. Oh my goodness. This is so cute, y'all. Y'all, these are some really pretty fall stems. Where were these when I was in the market? Okay, you guys, I'm safe. I'm safe. I got out of there with nothing on my person. I ain't even picked nothing up to put in the cart. I didn't see any stems that I was really feeling for right now. I have a very specific look or arrangement, I should say, that I want to recreate. So I'm going to wait to see if I find the exact leaves and floral items that I need but I'm gonna give Hobby Lobby some time to get all of their decor and stuff out because it just seems like they are still filling these shelves with things they got new folks folks don't know the answers to questions of things that I need and what's going on so we gonna give them a little bit of time which is perfect because I at least get to take out all of my decor and see what it is that I need versus what I want to pick up and add to but while we're here crack okay that thing right there is good I ain't even gonna hold you like huh Tian just told me that she added the vanilla sweet cold foam on top <sighs> I kind of regret not putting it on there. I just didn't. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. But this thing is good. I had to stop myself from taking it in the store because I almost finished it in one setting. Y'all, this is so grand and so cute. Can y'all not see this sitting on my fireplace cabinets? Like, are y'all into gingerbread houses? Because 
that is adorable this one is okay but it's not as grand as this one is this the new vibe i don't know let me see how much this one is because it's giving expensive because that other one is 79 how much is this smaller one 49 let's see this is 99 dollars, baby they have all of these boxes with these different assortment of ornaments that one is really cute if you're into the rose gold pinky type of feel these are some cute little ornaments all of them have so much character it's funny to me how they trying to shove this little thanksgiving decor right here okay i'm really trying to get into the vibe for our intro some brownies christmas tree shaped which i feel in they also have this little mold too this is cute yeah this little wine glass shape so cute to me y'all hear all of that ticking i'm in the pot aisle and they're sounding off they have these little alarms on them but i came over here for something very specific that my mom had just told me about that she found in her home goods and she was going to pick up for me and my sister but i was going to try to save her some work i need y'all to tell me what y'all's favorite christmas candles are they don't have to be from home goods but when i say all of this uh -uh. don't none of this be smelling good pine cinnamon none of that the best thing is probably a sugar cookie but see how that get too sweet and then they also have a vanilla cream in the same style of candle that i got that pumpkin fragrance from i might do that what does this one smell like macintosh apple okay Okay, that's not bad, but I don't know if I want my house smelling like that. I was just telling Sim we need to do more date nights at home, and I feel like this would be hilarious. <sighs> All right, so out of home goods, I saw some great inspo. I did pick a few things up, and I put it right back down because discipline. I almost got really overwhelmed with trying to rush and pick things up, but there is still time, okay? Made it back to the house, you guys, and Sim and I are about to cook dinner for tonight. <laughs> Then Crocky mate. It's got a big one. Ooh. Yeah, buddy. Rolling like a big shot. Chevy tuned up like a NASCAR pit stop. I forgot like two important ingredients today. How much you wanna bet that bitch still bust? I'm certainly will. Like always. Why you being the man, man? You walk outside. Come on. You walk. Come on. 
Look at that. Outside. What he okay. experienced. It's falling out in the damn flow. He's being dramatic. We should honestly probably bake it in here. That would make the most sense. Ooh. Look at that. Who? Who restaurant? House de Springer. Mm-hmm. Are you fucking kidding me? A flat tire line? What's wrong? A flat tire is not an emergency. See, you don't respect what I do right there. Do you know how important this business that meeting is on this? Huh? Hey, 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 I ain't gonna talk about that shit. Hey, you guys, happy Friday. So, your girl is up and out of the house, as y'all can see. And why is it raining outside? Hmm. Like the day that I wanted to go and get my car washed, it is raining. So I'm going to put that errand on the backhand because it doesn't even make any sense going to get all of that work done just for the rain to have my car looking dusty again. So I'm actually about to make my way to the post office to check my P.O. box and then I am going to take a trip to Lowe's as well as Home Depot. Since my parents are going to be coming up this weekend tentatively, I want to have my dad pull that toolbox out and help do a few things around the house i want to raise the curtain rod in the living room up to the ceiling so that we can get longer curtains for the holidays and then into next year i also want to put my shelves back up i want to change out the chandelier that's right there in the dining room slash open kitchen to living room area i am debating on changing out the fan but we're not gonna get too far ahead of ourselves because y'all see how this is sounding like a lot mm -hmm. I am going to paint the fireplace mantle and an accent wall in the guest bathroom. <laughs> you are doing a lot. See, this is my toxic trait. I really feel like the world can be conquered in a day. <laughs> I just named out so many things and today is Friday. They get here tomorrow halfway through the day and probably leaving early Sunday. So yeah, go figure as to how much of that we're going to get done. But I'm just a girl. I can dream, right? I do feel, however, if I just purchase what needs to get done, that's going to make me more inclined to do it. Does that make sense? So if it's sitting there in the house, like if I have the paint, if I have the tools, if I have the shelves ready to go, I'm just going to up and do it one day. Whether I'm waiting on my dad, me and Sim get the project done, or I do it by myself. Whatever the case may be. So... That's what we're going to do. Of course, I'm going to stop and get me a little matcha. I sat down to edit the portion of this vlog that you guys have already seen. So all of the footage from yesterday, I went ahead and knocked out because I'm trying to be more intentional about editing as I go so that these weekly vlogs don't take me two days to edit straight through so I can post them for you because my goal is to have this vlog up Sunday and being that this is about to be a busy weekend I'm already ahead of the curve so let me go ahead and get to Starbies mm -hmm, or Duncan whoever acting right today and of course I will see you guys there really quick I was in here thinking back to last night because I was like is there anything that I need to update y'all on that Netflix series, Family Business, girl, it's like a bad accident. You just can't stop watching and you don't want to turn your head, but well, when I say glorified Tubi series, that's exactly what it's given. Like the acting is terrible. The gunshots like, ah, I was losing my mind. And y'all know, Sim really don't have tolerance when things are just bad and poor. He feels like he's wasting his time watching it. But I was like, ah, let's keep going. Let's keep going. It might get better. But who child, if you guys have seen it, <laughs> please let me know because there's four seasons and we're only on season one, of course. But girl, I was cracking up. Other also, why was I looking so childish yesterday? I just felt so dry. I do need to wash my hair. Let's start there. And I told y'all, I got bad hair attitude. So that's really wearing on me, especially when my frizzies get to sticking up, my gel don't rub in good. Like what was going on? I was giving, just came off the playground yesterday and that is just not it for a grown ass woman. Y'all probably don't be seeing that bad on camera, but honey, 
Hence why I had to get my slick back together today and I had to put on some jewelry, put on some gloss before I got up on this camera looking dry again because absolutely not. Absolutely not. So if this is your first time here and you're still here, I fucks with you already, already. But um, yeah, yeah. Y'all ain't gotta worry about too much of that. Actually, let me go ahead and text Lanisa like, sis, um, <clears throat> this just made me think about it. My hair done, cause I'm finna go pick it up. I just changed a setting on my camera and I hope I don't look like a damn cartoon, but I just made the lens clear. Like, I don't know what the that even means, but here we are. So, I just pulled up to Starbucks, and for whatever reason, now I want something hot. Hey, could I please do a grande caramel brulee latte? It's going to be hot and can I have a pump of cinnamon dolce in there? Why I just cold switch like that? I just switched up. I don't know, I don't know. It's not that I haven't been in a matcha mode, but with the weather, it's giving a little cozy vibe and I just want something hot. Can y'all see a difference in the quality? Like, I feel like it makes the image more vivid, so it kind of color grades on camera versus me being able to color grade when I edit. I don't know, when I put this on the computer, we'll see. But I like how I'm showing up a little vibrant. Mm-hmm, mm. okay girl. Okay, I really need a monthly Starbucks budget because what I be going like twice a week? Don't answer that. Don't answer that. It's been twice this week. Don't answer that. Forget I asked the question. <laughs> Cause girl, what? Y'all, can we unpack about Kiki? I hate my good sis going through this. Thank you so much. You too. Ooh, nice and hot. They ain't do too bad on this latte now. Okay, I don't know how this caffeine finna have me bouncing off a wall, but I just pulled up to the post office. Let me make sure my key is still attached to my lanyard because it be just my look. Get up in there acting silly. All right, very good, very good. So let's go ahead and go inside. I'm not even sure if I'm gonna have to go through the line and I don't know what Lowe's I want to go to do you guys like Home Depot or Lowe's which one or do you go in between the two because my dad loves Lowe's but sometimes he can't find everything that he needs so he'll end up having to go to Home Depot we have a Lowe's that's close to us and a Home Depot in all the areas that I like to go shop so I'm just trying to figure out where do I want to be and I hope the rain don't come down no more but that's why I put this um the jacket on so that if it does i can at least try to protect the little bit of sleek i got to this bun let me go inside because here i am chatting, chatting, chatting. All right, so I got two packages, one of which I need to go to the clerk to pick up. So I didn't even peep if the line was long, but I'm really hoping that it's not. How you doing? I just need to pick up a package. Oh, you see it back there, so you have to come back on Monday when the box clerk uh, come back. You are. When the what now comes back? When the uh, box clerk come back, the box clerk come back, he'll be able to uh, get it for you. But I don't know where it is right now. Cute. Almost ain't getting my packages, y'all, but let me get in the car and I'll pick y'all back up. Oh, girl, back it up, back it up. I really hope this setting that I put my camera on does not have some funky looking clips. By the time I get to uploading this to my computer. Whew. All right, so I got two packages, one from Scented Hibiscus. Mm. Can't wait to open that. And this one feels like I don't know it's something kind of hard in there like a book a journal maybe but I'm gonna open those as soon as I get back to the house so now let's decide where we want to go for our little home improvement items 
Let me look at Moe's, see how far it is from here. It's probably the one on Camp Creek that it's gonna show me. Yep, the one off Camp Creek. Hell, now nah, we ain't going up there to Atlanta, so. Oh, there's one right there in Fayette. Okay, say no more. I like it, I like it. I really, really like it. So the lady in the post office almost sent me on without my package because she was reading the pickup slip wrong and this is why you gotta ask questions you gotta challenge folks when they tell you stuff sometimes sometimes because she was just like i'm gonna have to wait until the box clerk gets back on monday and i'm like damn why what's up what's going on and she was like she couldn't find it she searched everywhere so maybe he'll be able to further tell me and i was like um you looking for the right box because i'm this one up here does the date have anything to do with why you can't find my package and she was like girl i was looking at the wrong thing and i was like yeah ma'am yeah ma'am go on back there and get the right thing please before i leave here thinking that you can't find it and then my package go back to the sender it's crazy take a pledge to the team go kill and get money same future i just need my girlfriend we ain't gonna talk about it cut you off and keep pushing Meet me at the bank, show me what you really about Y'all niggas gotta pay me Put some respect on my team How this money gotta come through me Ay, Don't worry about why I do what I do Bitch, cut a nigga off and my checks got bigger I knock the shit out that bitch like an enema ah. If y'all knew me back in college, this is my shit Whoa. I like brand new shit, so this is what I love I like that money bag Once I get on with that bitch, she don't know how to act Okay, so I just pulled up to Lowe's. It looked kind of empty in this parking lot. I wonder if they got <laughs> anything up in there, but we're gonna try them out and see. This is my first time coming to this location. Uh-oh, Jim, <laughs> you in my business. I need to get my windows tinted up in this front because, Jesus. But while I'm in here trying to have a car concert, my camera on all at 10%, and we got a lot of stuff to like, why I play it like that? I know we gotta go to the track in. I feel like we're gonna need a cart. Oh, they talk to you. Santa standing a little bow leg, ain't it? So I kinda like this one, but I'm not sold on it at all. This one is kinda cool and futuristic looking, but eh. These are very similar to what we have, but that's given we're gonna have to take them off and do a lot of dusting with them being open that way. Now this one back here is really cute, but it's gonna be way too low for the space. Y'all, this music in here is so loud, but I'm about to move on to the next project because I'm not seeing no light fixtures in here to replace the chandelier. Wow, guys. Thanks for coming in today. So, do you have a sanding machine or is this like a good sander? Like the little handheld thing. Okay, so they also have this down here. Okay. Which one did I choose? Same price. Okay. Dad, what's the name of the paint that you be using? I was actually going to head to Walmart after this to pick up one of these, but since they have it in here, probably just gonna get it. As y'all know, I picked up some carpet cleaner the other day, but I really need this brush because I don't know where the one from our vacuum went and yeah, we gotta clean that rug in the front room. Okay, you guys, it's getting a little chaotic. Need some frog tape. Girl, this blue, I thought that was black, child. Dark kettle black. Okay, or this caviar is pretty. Phew, okay, so your girl is home and I'm about to go ahead and open up these P.O. Box packages. My camera died while I was inside of Lowe's. I picked up everything that you guys pretty much saw, checked out, and I did take a run to Home Depot. 
they ain't have nothing. I was going to go make that return to Target. I didn't feel like it. So here we are. Sim just went out to grab our dinner for tonight because we ate leftovers earlier on today for lunch. He was off today. He went and got a haircut and everything, child. So let's see what's inside of the package from Scented Hibiscus. Ooh. These packing peanuts, no, they be something else. Ooh, baby got some weight up on her. Hold on, let me open this up. Are these candles? Yes, and the luxury baby. Get into it. Well, uh, look at that. This is so pretty, y'all. Oh, okay. Clovery trail. That smells really good. Mm -hmm. I can definitely smell the cinnamon and the clove in there. That smells so good. And that candle is so pretty. Like, I just want to set that up on my dresser. That is so cute. Okay, what's this one? Autumn Sky. This is pumpkin and clove scented. Mmm. Girl, these smell professional. Okay. Lux Coconut Apricot Cream Wax. <laughs> Baby, look. Let me set these up right here. Mm-hmm. Y'all see the material. Okay, and this one is vanilla supreme and it's a vanilla and cashmere mm. y'all these smell so 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 good oh my goodness they're the perfect warm fragrances for your home they're definitely giving the fall winter vibe let me see if there's a card or anything in here okay no there's not but you guys be sure to go support and shop with scented hibiscus i'm going to put their website on the screen go grab you some of these beautiful luxe candles to sit up on your countertops and burn nice and slow because they give those vibes for sure i can't wait to go set these up around the house thank you so so much for sending these candles from your line my girl now this package let me be careful when i cut it yes i knew it was a book of some sort now what type of book is it Ooh, i am all right with me okay adriana brie we love that honey Serving face on that book cover. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's see. Oh, wait, 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 y'all. Okay, I Am All Right With Me is a self-help journal for a woman on the journey to find herself and happiness. I hope through my transparency and wounds, you find healing. I long for the day when you too can find the courage to get up again. I am rooting for you. You are stronger than you think. The world is longing for you, your gifts, and that special light. Only you can shine. Just remember, actually, you can. Love, Adriana Brie. Y'all, this is so cute okay so first of all this is the opening page with that message that i just read and as you go through she has all types of things in this journal she has all of her socials right here in january i am grateful for you have your goals your strengths your weaknesses improvements lessons learned okay then you have your vision board page let me keep going here you also have books you want to read. There are quotes throughout the book. Oh, yes. Okay. What loving yourself looks like has a few pointers here. I'm not going to read everything to y'all because y'all need to go shop and support. Write a love letter to yourself. Oh my God, this is beautiful. And then it has like Monday through Sunday. It looks like affirmations that you can read, checklists, practice and showing up for yourself every single day. Yes, and it's going through like the month. So this is March now. These are affirmations. So they're filled on this side and you would fill in right here on this side. Girl, this is beautiful. Hold on. 
every month there's a new challenge new things that you're grateful for new goals morning routine okay so she has already filled out this half of the answers and then these same questions you fill out your half this is so 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 nice y'all yes my girl yes my girl so i'm gonna put all of her socials right here on the screen be sure to go out there and get this self-love journal i am all for this when i say i love everything about this definitely gonna crack this open for the new year and utilize each and every page in here thank you so much girl for sending over this journal it's beautiful it's beautiful Whew. but yes you guys i think that is it for tonight since i was so unsuccessful with my hunt for this chandelier i am gonna get on amazon right now because i have seen some really 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 cute ones online and i'm gonna see if i can order something that will come between tomorrow and sunday if not it can wait it's not high priority especially that fan back there but what i really want to take care of is putting these shelves back up and painting the frame around the fireplace so i am just going to unwind and wait for simon deuce to get back with dinner for tonight we're probably going to start a new series or watch some type of movie and call it a night i will see you guys first thing in the a.m you guys so sim is all set up and ready to paint how much of that do we have left Half that should be fine should be. so this microfibered roller is supposed to be like a smoother finish not give off any lint and stuff some white man on tiktok told me about it so let's see you think it's gonna work? Yeah, it should be fun. I was so dry the other day on the camera. I said, never again will I get on camera looking like I came off the playground. What, are you talking about closing out the video? No, I was just a whole day worth of vlogging, looking oh. crusty. Mouth was white, looked like ain't nobody left. Yeah, that's me. why I would be like trying to make sure I get some um, lip gloss, Vaseline, something. Mm -hmm. Try to open that up and get a little bit of light because it's car dark. Felt gloomy. Yeah. Had to clean myself up, but look who's here. Hey guys. I got mommy kids. We're about to go to Home Goods, get into some trouble. Good hey. trouble, good trouble. I'm cold. Y'all, do y'all see how I'm dressed? It's Atlanta, baby. It's cold out here. I mean, it's cold in Augusta, but whew, it's cold here. Um, ma'am. I was just wearing a two-piece sleeveless <laughs> bra top outfit out the door. And here we are. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Do you want to take it down and we do it later? Oh, well, you can hold it. Be of some service. You ain't doing nothing else. Girl. I come to your city, I drive. You come to That's my right. city, I drive. We just had this conversation. Mm -hmm. Mama, we just got through the door. Sorry. I mean, Y'all, look at this. Beautiful. But it's ninety nine dollars. Look at that. It's like a little bar. Okay, Santa. He real cool, honey, with his PJs on and his bedroom slippers. It's actually pretty cool. How much is it? Forty nine. Hmm, it's not bad. That's quite different. I've never seen anything like this before. It peels it and then it slices it up like that. 
with the box looking better? Mm -hmm. Yeah, because this box look like it stank. Yeah, that box look like it stank down there. See, that's better. No. Look at my mama getting my wine glasses, y'all, and rearranging these folks' furniture. Out with the old, in with the new. I think they're fine. Mm -hmm. Now tell the folks what you came in here for today, Cheryl. I came with you. Uh-uh, you came in here for something. Y'all, we didn't got Jack for our buggy, but this is our karma because this one over here, she always stealing somebody buggy when we go to the store. So, oh, <laughs> they done took all of her stuff out, <laughs> put it on the shelf, and then they took our buggy. Now she got me babysitting the cart like I don't want to shop. What you talking about? Girl. What? Got me watching the cart. This look like it's gonna hold nothing but lint, huh? It already has lint on it, so Girl. it's a nut. Is this a joke? That's the wrong tag. Mama. Got to be. Daddy. Why you talking about this linty? Is it cashmere? <laughs> <laughs> but see, that's linty. Nasty. It's not that it's linty, it's just that whatever was on it messed it up, so. Uh-uh, that's looking nasty. Another day, you guys. Day two. Oh, we had a great breakfast this morning. Now we're about to. We had a great food. dinner. Last night. Oh yeah, dinner was good. Dinner was real good last night. You done cut up. Oh. It was just a different vibe. You didn't tell the folks why I was here. Why was you here? I'm not here for you. Oh, it's Shayna's birthday. I told them. Oh, okay. How yeah, this is a whole vlog, baby. They know why you're here. But I mean, you know, of course, for their favorite, they'll do anything. <laughs> Look at Cheryl. Then came in here opening up these folks' screws. We'd have got caught, y'all. So he taught us to do like this to know what screw was going to fit instead of opening up all their packages. Because we done cut up. So that's the size that we need, huh? Yeah. Take it. You take it. So the original outfit is perfect. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, we can just, what we can do is buy the box that we Nuts and washes. Did the knob fit up there? And it's on this metric. We found this gym in McDonough. Nice and peppery. You got peppery? Mm hmm. Uh -huh. I did. You did? So that means we need more peppers then. Ooh, baby, look, don't y'all see I'm over here squeezed up in a corner of the house that y'all have never seen before because the remainder of it is in disarray. But all of the projects that I named out, 
are about 75% done. So I'm feeling good. I just really need to spend today, tomorrow, the rest of the week cleaning up and putting things back where they belong because it got kind of hectic in here. And yeah, your girl wasn't able to film everything because as y'all saw, I was running around the streets with my mama. We celebrated Shayna's birthday together. Just went out to Juicy Crab to get some good little din din and spent some good quality time, which was very much so needed and appreciated as always. I love, love, love when I'm able to visit my family and when they're able to come here to visit us. Whew. Let's go back to all of what you guys seen in this vlog. I know it was kind of all over the place. There were so many moments that I wasn't able to really expound on. Like, girl, I'm fighting for my life. I tried to pick up this camera as much as I could and I was able to. But yeah, I dropped the ball some days. And it's okay. It's okay because we're going to make sure that we stay up on that Zoom no matter what. And this vlog was drawn out for, what, two or three weeks? time to wrap it up it is time to wrap it up so with that being said today's our anniversary it's super early in the morning so i am just trying to knock out any little bit of work that i was going to do today so i can have the day off sim is off as well we don't have anything planned but i'm really thinking that this is going to be a chill type of entry into year three because we're celebrating two years right okay so we got married in 2021 that was year one to 2022 this was year two to 2023 and now we're moving into year three to 2024 does that make sense is that how you count anniversaries girl am i up here on this camera sounding like three times three times three is 18 please let me know <laughs> <laughs> if you have seen that video on the shade room then you know what i'm referencing y'all know i know what the hell three times three times three is but anyway anyway you gotta know the joke to get the joke but um that's making sense right so we're celebrating two years of marriage but we're moving into year three Mm-hmm, 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 period, period. But yeah, you guys, I'm not sure what we're going to get into today. Of course, you guys will see that on the next vlog, but yeah back to what i was going to tell y'all when you spam the comment section down below what happy anniversary because i know that's what y'all finna do be sure to put the clinking wine glasses and a green heart with it so that i can know you made it to this point in today's video because these long vlogs be tearing that ass up tat 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 it up okay and i need to make sure that you guys are appreciating them and you're making it to the ending because this is important it is it is important because i want to scale them back to 30 45 minutes that's what i would love to do but um if y'all like it i love it and i'll continue to bring the fives every single time but without further ado let me stop drawing out this clip if you enjoyed today's video be sure to give it a thumbs up you already right know hit that comment section down below tap the red subscribe button if you haven't done so already and don't forget to hit the bell so you don't miss notifications every time i upload i love you guys so much and i'll see y'all in the next one peace guys <laughs>